arthritis just means pain in the joint. For us, it's just a, a, an entry point of evaluating someone. And we're trying to sort them out uh, in a variety of ways and, and put them in groups where we can manage them effectively. And some of these are things that you need to diagnose right away because they can be life threatening. So I think that uh, if they, people can learn what I call the red flags, and we are often educating primary care physicians and people who see uh, persons at the first instance, what some of these uh, dangerous signals are of things that need to be sorted early, referred early to someone who knows about them. So, uh, I, and I'm sure that everyone on the panel can weigh in, but um, I think any um, symptom, and this includes uh, other uh, uh, bodily symptoms, where the symptoms don't go away after a couple of weeks of self-care or time, you should worry, or if they're getting worse during that period of time. Uh, if uh, it's uh, something that prevents critical function, uh, this might be as uh, a breadwinner or uh, a vital function for your job. Obviously, it may not be as urgent medically, but from a social point of view, it's critical in terms of keeping someone uh, in the game. Uh, and the other group of arthritis disorders that always worry us are people who have arthritis plus something else, particularly what we call systemic or constitutional symptoms. That's like weight loss, unintended, uh, fatigue, yeah. fever, unexplained rash. All of those things on top of an arthritis condition can uh, uh, suggest a more serious or treatable illness or that the arthritis is just a manifestation of a what we call a systemic illness that really needs to be sorted out early. Mm -hmm.